Looking for a quick and easy snack idea? Well, Baker Megfield has got you covered. Welcome to Quarantine Kitchen. Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of Quarantine Kitchen. I'm Baker Megfield and today we are going to make one of ESPN's staple snacks, Energy Bites. They're super simple, delicious, and relatively healthy. So let's get going. I got this recipe off of quakeroats.com, but I have found a variety of recipes all over the internet that you can add different things to. You can add white chocolate chips, dark chocolate chips, pretty much all the add-ins you put in trail mix, you can put in these. But for today, my version, you will need two and a half cups of rolled oats, about a cup of mashed bananas, that's about two ripe bananas. I like bananas on the riper side for things like this. When you mash them, it just makes it easier. Two tablespoons of honey, a quarter cup of peanut butter. You can use chunky or smooth, I'm using smooth. And then I have about three tablespoons of chocolate chips, mini chocolate chips. This is one of my add-ins of choice. And one tablespoon of flax seeds. And then also a little bit of cinnamon just to sprinkle in. So to start, we're going to peel and mash these bananas. And while I'm mashing these bananas, I'm going to stick the peanut butter in the microwave for about 15 seconds. It just melts it a little bit and will make it easier to mix in. Now that the bananas are mashed, you're just going to add the remaining ingredients. So I have my peanut butter, I'm gonna do my honey next, and I'm gonna kind of mix all of the wet ingredients together first. And then I'm going to add my oatmeal. And then I'm going to add my chocolate chips and my flax seeds. Sprinkle in some cinnamon. Cinnamon is one of my favorite spices at the moment. I add it to so many things. Yogurt, pancakes, my mom even sometimes will sprinkle it in coffee before she brews it. And it ends up delicious. As you can see, we have this nice sort of combined mixture here. Now I'm going to take a baking sheet. I have lined it with parchment paper and sprayed it with cooking spray for the extra non-stick factor. And then I'm going to roll it into little balls. Just place it on cheek. So now that we have this tray of energy balls ready to go, I'm going to put it in the freezer for about 15 to 20 minutes. You could also put it in the refrigerator for a little bit longer, but I'm impatient and want my snacks fast. So in the freezer it goes. All right, it's been about 20 minutes, so let's check the freezer. Would you look at this perfect tray of delicious looking energy bites? And it's now time for the best part, the taste test. Yum! Banana-y, peanut buttery, hints of chocolate. What more could you want in a snack? This is the perfect thing to grab when you're running out the door or take with you for a walk or a hike or something outside now that it's getting nicer. Simple, quick, easy energy bites from quakeroats.com. Be sure to store, store them in a cool place. I'm gonna enjoy this and I will catch you guys later.